head coach Dale Louie after the 2017 Bobcat Invitational. Coach, the men wrapping up the race here this afternoon. Uh, looking at this course, what are some of the challenges that it presents compared to some of the other courses that you've run at? Uh, our course has a reputation of being hilly. You know, it's Rossburg environment. Uh, we've tried to constantly improve the course to make it a little bit faster. I think we're achieving that. Uh, you really saw it on the women's side today, but the men's course is a little bit faster too. Uh, it's a thinking course. You know, if, if the fastest person doesn't always win these races. It's the person who plans out what they're doing, uh, who usually has the best, best performances. And uh, I, I thought a number of our men did that today. I was very happy to see that. You never know if that's going to transpire during the course of a race, but uh, it, you know, most of them did a nice job of that. And on the men's side, how would you gauge their performance relative to some of the competition here today? Uh, we, we don't see a lot of these schools, so that's, that's a tough question to, to answer. Uh, we, we do know that uh, you know, Alderson brought us and Tru Truett, uh, McConnell have some, have some good runners. Uh, some of the uh, you know, uh, teams here, uh, like ours, are a little bit hurt with uh, a little flu going around the area right now, so it really uh, messed some of the teams up, including ours a little bit. Robert Romano obviously having a great season. How would you gauge his race here today? Robbie's been sick all week long, so he ran, uh, kind of goes back to what I said a little while ago, he ran very smart, he, he held back early in the race. Uh, normally I think you would have saw him out there with uh, uh, probably the top 10 much sooner than he was here today. Uh, but you can see that he, he moved up as the race went on, and that was very crucial to our, to our team score. Who were some other performers that uh, impressed you here this afternoon? Uh, I mean, really, we had we had a really good top nine here today. Uh, you know, Lorenzo Wilson uh, is starting around into shape. Uh, he moved up a lot during the course of the race there. Tanner Jacobs had uh, a very strong race. He was our number five runner here today. Uh, Jake Rickers and Timmy Wolotkin continue to work together there as our number two and three runner. Uh, Braxton Clark, uh, you know, a, a freshman, uh, really nice run here today. Uh, these guys are continuing to make improvement, and uh, it's going to be a little exciting to see where we're at by the end of the school year. All right, thank you, Coach.